Hey guys, welcome back to another tutorial and in this tutorial I'm going to be talking about this website called appmacup.com and basically it allows you to create really easy photos and screenshots for you to upload to your um, App Store Connect to get your app uh, on the App Store. So basically a lot of people, every time you upload a new app to the App Store you need to um, take some screenshots of it and things and you need to uh, just take photos of it to show what the app does and show uh, your viewers how nice it is so this is just uh, a document 360 app I made it a few months ago uh, I actually made a tutorial on it but basically this is all it is and yeah now this isn't too important I've already made the app and all that but in this uh, video I'm just going to be talking about this um, website and basically it allows you to make quality app screenshots really easily so first of all what you need to do is click start now and you can select uh, iOS devices and we can do is if I go to this it's got an iPhone 12 Pro Max and you can choose them so it's only got two devices right now and I think you can change that around uh, if I go to devices uh, I think if I select new device I can go to iOS devices and just select everything I want um, but I think they've not got further than the 11 it hasn't been updated in a while but that's good enough so here we have the iPhone 11 and uh, let me just run it for this so iPhone 11 Pro Max I'll just run it for that so you get that up and running and while waiting you can see that this is actually our um, thing so this is the screenshot and you can see that it's already uh, nice and um, I don't know how to say it but just good <laughs> so I'm just gonna move the 11 over here and you can see that the 11 is over here and you want this screen to be over here so we can do that but what we're gonna do is this is basically just a website which allows you to change around the um, layout usually you'd have to go into Photoshop or another photo editing software to get something like this but here if you just go to templates you can select pretty much anything so uh, let's see if I was just making a sort of like I don't know maybe like uh, a message app or something I'll just click that and you can see it's preparing and you can see four different slides now to edit these text things uh, what you can do is you can go to title change this out and a very useful app you can see it updating in the real time and you can also add in a subtitle <laughs> very useful but I'm guessing this I'm guessing this template doesn't actually have a subtitle but the other one did and you can also change around the layout so you can move where the title goes like if you moved it there you can see it's covering the top but now we actually get a subtitle as well so yeah that's pretty useful and basically you can just use this to just create your app screenshots and then you can add the photo in um, if, you, if you click frame edit or something like this uh, you can just do it and then you can just add this photo in later and it's just a created photo. So yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in a future tutorial. Bye!